Antonio Brown, a.k.a. A.B., oh, he been just trolling and just clowning everybody on Twitter and on social media lately, oh, you right. know. So now he clowning on um, LeBron James because LeBron James was at a game and these two white women were sitting beside him and just steady grabbing on him, leaning on him. And it just looked kind of crazy, I must say. So A.B. put out a meme uh, of LeBron James, it looked like he in the middle of like a porn set, and it called he got game too. But my whole thing is, it's a couple things wrong with this. Why are these white women on LeBron this hard in public? And this is a married man. And another thing, why does AB got this much time on his hand? Right. That he got to speak on everything going on. At this right. point, he need a podcast. You know what I'm saying? He don't need a podcast. Oh, no, nah, he don't. Cause he really it, don't. Oh, man, he really going to go crazy. That's what I'm saying. He's just going to be talking talking that crap just to be talking Yeah, because it's like a couple oh, weeks ago, he, he was still podcast. talking about smashing Tom Brady wife mm -hmm. and... Mm -hmm. So he gonna be getting people hurt and people mad and, and nobody got time for that. Like Yeah, but besides him trolling LeBron, man, how you feel about, you know, Bron, you know, having this conversation courtside with these two white females and they just all up on him. Like both of them, like they cannot keep their hands off of this man. If you see the video, man, I'm going to show you the video right quick so you can mm -hmm. speak on it. So you can know what I'm talking about, man. It just look crazy, man. So from your perspective as a black woman, speak on that, man, because mm -hmm. you know, we really can't, when you at LeBron level, you can't, have that type of you know energy around you man because it leads to these type of conversations I'm not I'm not gonna I got so much respect for LeBron so I'm not gonna assume anything but the average person gonna look at this and be like oh yeah LeBron probably didn't took these two chicks back to the room or you know what I'm saying it just it just leaves way too much room for speculation I mean he could either be on some, I know I'm innocent, so I don't give up, you know? Right. Or he just really just forgot for the moment that, like, people really just, like, go make up narratives and stories because I'm in the public eye mm. and people see me and are paying attention to every little thing that I do. Right, right, you right, right, right. So, you know, I just feel like... Either you can take it for what it is. I mean, I doubt a man like LeBron, let's just say if there was a mistress, I don't think he would be like out hanging out with no, you know what I'm saying? Just right. be openly disrespectful. I don't see that being a man of his character at all. Like him just being openly disrespectful. I think for a moment he could either for had just forgot, like, damn, you know, I'm I'm a public figure. I mean, he's a human being. Right, you know right, what I'm saying? Right. Or, you know, yeah. He was just like, Well, these are ladies. I'm, you know, a star. At the end of the day, people are gushing over me all the time. Right. And I don't give a crap what you think, like as long as I'm I'm chilling. Cause that's like giving some like I'm innocent. Cause he knows you know, especially with him being seen and, you know, even heard of as a noble man. Like, you know, he ain't going to just openly disrespect his queen like that. I don't see that. Because at the end of the day, like, Brown was just talking. He was chilling. Like, yeah. they the ones that couldn't yeah. keep his, and, and their hands off him. You can see, but he's the basketball star. And at the right. end of the day, you're going to have some people who don't know boundaries. There you go. Who don't, who don't understand boundaries. I mean, Everybody's talking about them. Like, why are you touching a married man like that? You don't see that? Right, right. It look crazy. They look, look crazy. crazy. They look crazy for that. They know. And they know his, his reputation. You know what I'm saying? So, yeah. At the end of the day, it, it is what it is. But once again, they could have just been caught up in the gush of him and being around him and right, forgot right, about right. the fact that, like, people are paying attention to. You know what I'm saying? But the reality is, you know, you got to get yourself together. You ever been that married? Your you ever been married? Not yet. <laughs> Not yet? Nah. You want to be married or you just want to be free and just live your life? Single? Well, I have a thing where I feel like I want to be married. 
Right. Okay. So I got some babies and really like settle in. You and... want babies too? Oh yeah, I want babies. How many kids you want? Mm, I want like three. Okay. I want, like three. All right, but I say this. Hold on. Hold on. But if I end up marrying and I find out that it's not what I want, I am willing to like. Go get you a 22 year old NBA player. Not a 22 year old. No. <laughs> no. Hey, hey, thank you, thank you, thank you for watching this video. Go hit that subscribe button and every single day more videos like this will be uploaded. Hey, thank you again. Hey. Check, check, check.